have no color, just like me. <laughs> for you. There are lots of problems in the city because you took away all the colors. Morpho can help Chroma paint everything back to its original colors again. Hi there. Somehow our fire truck lost its color. Morpho and Chroma can help you with that. A fire truck is always red, just like you. <laughs> Thank you so much, Morphle and Crowba. <laughs> Hi, Cloud Monster. Problems in the city already. Morphle and Chroma make a great team together. Chroma really likes coloring. It sure does. Hmm. I have an idea. Chroma, do you want a human companion that loves color? You 
You're the perfect magic pet for a painter like me. to the garage. Morphle, morph into a tow truck. Hi, hi, hi! With these wheels, we have become driving pirates. I think land pirates works better, Maurice. Hmm. This is great! Give that back, Pirates! It's Mila and Morphle! <laughs> we'll be back. Probably. Thank you, Mila and Morphle! <laughs> Ah! Oh, no. The car's engine is gone. Oh, no. We'll bring it to the garage to get it fixed. Yeah! Mechanic Joe. Uh oh. There are more cars with missing parts? I wonder who would steal all those things. Stop them! They took my award. It's the pirates! Give us your hat. Come on! It was a water balloon. It's not working. Ha <laughs> ha With all the engines we took, our ship is too strong to be stopped like that. Shoot them, Pirate Phil! Morpho Loki, stop them! Oh man! Aha! Uh -huh. We should stop them from driving. Morphle, take all their wheels off. Oh no, stop that. you pirates. <sighs> and now I'm taking you to jail. Wow. Since they're so good at mechanical things, why don't we have them fix all the cars instead? Good idea. Yeah. The car's fixed. I really enjoyed this pirate, Maurice. <laughs> Well, I have seen enough wheels for a while. <laughs> Here we are. I've heard that there is a very special magic pet on this island. Morpho, want to see? Yeah, me too. Morpho, morph back into yourself so we can go into the jungle. Ooh, I think I see it. Are you ready, Daddy? Daddy? Daddy Kong! Uh-oh. Let's go find him. Ah! Blanky! <laughs> hmm. Maybe you can see Daddy from the trees. Morph into a monkey, Morphle. Morpho, now see Daddy! 
<laughs> scary! Yeah. But when you're with me, I don't feel scared at all. <laughs> Look, Morphle. That elephant's trunk is stuck underneath that tree. Uh-oh. Morphle, morph into an elephant as well, so you can lift up that tree. I wonder where the sound comes from. Ooh, look over there, Morphle. Pretty birdies! Morphle, morph into a bird as well. <laughs> now fly up high and look if you can see Daddy. It sounded really close by, Morphle. Yeah! Oh, no! Mila! Morphle! That's Daddy's voice. Let's go, Morphle. Mila! Morphle! Are you there? Daddy now here? No. Oh, look! Is anyone there? Hello, bird. <laughs> So you were the one making that scary sound. <sighs> that was great. Do you really think so? <laughs> yeah. You must be the magic pet Daddy told us. Help! Was that you? It wasn't me. Real Daddy. We need to help him. Mila! Morphle! Are you there? Morph into a big dog! Thank you, Morphle, Mila, and... <laughs> ah, you are the magic pet. Great! Let's read a fairy tale, Morphle. Yeah! Fairy tale! Okay. Once upon a time, Mila and Morphle were walking through a forest, and inside that forest, they saw a house made of candy. Wow! They were really hungry and wanted to eat the house. Mm -mm. Oh no! What is happening? Mila challenge! But I don't want to be so big. Let's go look for a cure to make me small again. Yeah! What are you doing? I got turned into a giant, and now we're looking for a cure to make me small again. That's awesome! Troy the dragon will help you. <laughs> the dragon helps them? This is a very silly fairy tale. You know, I hear they can cure anything in that castle over there. Great! Let's go there! Oh, no, you don't! I'm a pirate! Yar! And there's a bounty on giants! Oh, no! I'll protect you, Giant Mila! Way too easy. 
What your fairy tale needs is an evil wizard. <laughs> Only by defeating me can Mila become small again. Oh no, it's the evil wizard! You can never defeat me! We'll see about that. Roar! I'll send it right back to you. Ouch! That hurts! I'll stop him. And you can't fly if your balloon is leaking. Whoa! whoa. Create a portal so you won't even get close. Oh no! How can we stop the evil wizard? Um, would anyone like a cookie? Cookies! Mm. Uh, why? Thank you. Oh, I have an idea. The evil wizard can't say what he does to stop us with his mouth full. What? Mila the giant grabs the evil wizard so he can escape. I'll shoot him with my cannon. Yeah, and I'll use my fire. My fire, I need to beat him. <laughs> Thanks for bringing us, Mila and Morphle. Now, I can give the mountain giant a tour of the city. No problem, Daddy. Have fun on the tour. Let's go, Morphle. Morph into a race car. Here, put this on. This way, no one will be able to guess that you're a mountain giant. Giant. Easy, it's all right. Don't be scared. <laughs> Stop. Come back. Huh? Oh, not in my city. What happened here? It was a big guy who did this. A big guy with glasses and a mustache. Hmm. That sounds like Mila's dad. I'm on it. Wait. Why am I being arrested? You ruined my city. I don't know how you did it, but you did it. What happened? Mila and Morph, please go look for the mountain giant. I think he's very scared. And please get me out of here. All right, we're on it. I'm sure if we follow the path of destruction, we will find the mountain giant. Morph into a race car, Morph. The trail ends here, so we must be around here somewhere.
There you are, Mr. Mountain Giant. Are you all right? Good. But we need you to help us out. Daddy is in jail for the mess you made in the city. Do you want to help us clean up the city? That's great! Let's go! Ha-ha! <laughs> Monster! No, Officer Freeze. This is Daddy's friend, the Mountain Giant. He's the one who made a mess of the city. He's very sorry, but he has put everything back the way it was. Well, uh, all right then. And I can't put you in jail anyway. You're way too big. Really? All right. And you're free to go as well. Thanks, officer. Thank you very much for coming back and clearing my name, Mr. Mountain Giant. That was very brave of you. <laughs> Happy Easter, Mr. Mayor. Did you find any eggs yet? <sighs> I don't think anybody has yet. Here, take a look at this note. Hmm, what does this say? This year, Easter will be a lot more difficult. I've hidden the eggs in hard places. Good luck. Signed, <gasps> the Easter Bunny. Oh, that sounds interesting. Right, Morphle? Yeah! Interesting? We haven't been able to find any eggs. How about Morphle and I look for the eggs and bring them here? That would be great, Mila. Thank you. Morphle, morph into a hot air balloon. Be careful now, kids. If I were the Easter Bunny, where would I hide the egg? Now you've done it, humans. You had no right to litter our planet. Wow, easy, Mr. Alien. What's going on? One of your Earth pets came to our planet and started putting weird objects everywhere. Could you please show it to us, Mr. Alien? Sure, if you promise to clean it up. Will do. Morphle, morph into a rocket. You see, that weird furry creature just dropped them off here and left. It's the Easter eggs. Easter eggs? What's that? When it's Easter, the Easter Bunny hides eggs for all of us to find. And inside the eggs are presents. That sounds fun. Let's go find some more. Yeah. Is this an Easter egg? <laughs> no, that's a rock. Is this an Easter egg? No, that's also a rock. Is this an Easter egg? Hey, let go of my head. Uh, we're sorry. Uh, we haven't found any more Easter eggs in space. Maybe we can try Earth again? I will look around space some more. See you in a bit. Uh, I hope he's able to find some real Easter eggs and not just rocks again. There you are. Did you find some eggs? We have, but I don't think we found enough for the whole town. Oh. There you are, Mila and Morphle. It's the alien! I found some more eggs! Oh no, not more rocks! You did it! 
you found real Easter eggs. Here, have an Easter egg for yourself, too. Thank you, Mila. But I've already found my favorite egg. And it's right here. <laughs> and that's where I found the most beautiful flower of my bouquet. Too bad I didn't put them in water. Wonderful. Uh, I mean, the story. <laughs> Too bad about the flowers. Next up to tell about her weekend, Mila. Yay! My weekend began very peacefully. I was playing with Morphle when suddenly... Mila, it's terrible. Asteroids are about to hit the city, and we need you to stop them. Sounds like trouble. Morphle, morph into a giant robot. Morphle, you super mega punch. You're my hero. And mine. That's awesome. Marvel is so cool. Sure sounds like an exciting weekend, Mila. Who's next? Oh, I'm just getting started. Oh, Mila, the bandits have a huge dragon. There's no way I can arrest him now. Marvel, morph into a robot again. Let's warm them up a little. Use the super ultra heat shield, Morphle. No way! No, you dumb dragon! My hero. It just keeps getting better. Are you sure it happened that way, Mila? You bet! And I'm not done yet! And that heat shield! Amazing! That dragon is probably still cowering in a cave somewhere. Hey, wait! That's my car! Morphle? Robot! Super Mega Car Smash! I'm sorry, Mila, but purple space bunnies... really? Well, that's what I saw. Recess, children! Oh, God, kids these days. Such lively imaginations. Oh, dear! <laughs> My growth ray can be used to turn these small plants into big trees. That's so cool! Tumbling test tubes. The battery is running out. <laughs> oh, that's what I get for buying those cheap knockoffs. Ah, here we go. <gasps> Look! It's 
a giant bird. Don't worry, I'll shrink it back. Uh-oh, it stopped working again. Morphle, morph into a pterodactyl. A giant bird? Not in my... Uh, hey! Give me back my sandwich! I hope you get indigestion! He keeps looking for new food! Let's lead him out of the city! Bob's farm. Here, the bird has enough food to eat until Professor Rasheed arrives. What happened to all my corn? There's only one cob left. Hmm. We can take care of that. Amazing. That's prize-winning corn right there. 